With the Central Coast's earlier win in Wellington, there was to be no Premier's plate for Brisbane, but Sunday evening on the Gold Coast may still have been an historic one, perhaps for the wrong reasons if, as many suspect, we were witnessing the last rights of United. Coach Ange Postacoglu exploited the FFA's bizarre decision not to hold simultaneous kickoffs by naming a virtually unrecognisable starting side, which included a debut for the Raw's reigning Youth Player of the Year, James Donaghy. Day-old fish permutations not quite eventuating as both sides made a lightning start to the final regular season match of the year. Brisbane denied what looked like a clear-cut penalty before one of the Gold Coast's youngsters fired the home side into a 29th minute lead. This time for Daniel Ball! Gold Coast United 1, Brisbane Raw 0. Jared Tyson made a sharp save to deny Enrique and Taj Minicon on for the injured James Brown saw his shot flash just wide of the goal as Gold Coast maintained their lead heading to the break. Bostokoglu brought on another youngster, Nick Fitzgerald, at half-time and 12 minutes after his introduction, he changed the contest. He does pull the trigger. This time he scores and Brisbane Raw are back on level terms. It was perhaps fitting that the Gold Coast's final chance fell to Mitch Cooper, the teenager whose elevation to club captain two months ago sparked the freefall that United now find themselves in. But there was to be no final fairy tale. Yet another of the raw Cubs, George Lambarderidis, blasting home a late, late goal that will be on his highlights reel for years to come. What a goal! So Brisbane now move towards the finals, but the big question is what happens to Gold Coast? Scott McIntyre, The World Game.